Now, rape culture, especially when it comes to our children, is completely abnormal. This is something that is completely against our code, um, you know, from our history and our ancestry. We never did this back in the day. This was behavior that was basically rooted from Europeans, from the Caucasians, from these troglodyte bastard devils like you see here. It's unfortunate that South Africa is one of the highest countries in when it comes to rape culture, when it comes to sexual violence, when it comes to sexual deviancy, one of the highest in the world. Um, and it's unfortunate that children is under that category. And, you know, with this guy, this troglodyte devil bastard um, raping a seven year old girl with blood everywhere on his body is just complete disgusting. And this again, this is behavior that was taught by them. They taught this type of behavior and passed it down to our people in Africa. Again, this is unnatural abhorrent behavior coming from them you see i mean quick history if you study the moors and you understand that the moors who are black the moors um you know they taught civilization to the caucasoid devils to the europeans when they found when they found these europeans in the mountains in the caves, in their natural habitat. Again, they were bathing and, and, and eating in their own feces. You know, they were they were acting like complete, utter savages. And we civil we civilized them. All of the uh, I mean, when it comes to eating feces and bathing your own feces and, you know, necromancing, raping, um, incest, all of that, all of the sexual deviancy came from them and their culture. And and we, we civilized them as the Moors. Um, but quick, real quick with this story, uh, I just saw this. I saw this story on, on Instagram. Shout out to uh, once again to the Savoy show. Uh, a guy by the name of Nicholas Nino uh, rapes. A little girl who's around six or seven years old in South Africa at a restaurant in um, Silvertown Pretoria and I'll play the video real quick actually it's a better video right here it's pretty disturbing to watch so I just just give you guys a heads up you see all that blood it's just disgusting Look at that blood. Butt naked. In a bathroom. Just disgusting. Disgusting, sad, and everything. And you know, again, children, infants. This, this happens to infants too. Stories of infants being brutally sodomized and raped and, 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 and you know infested with diseases it's really just abhorrent devilish you know innate behavior that they the dominant white society these caucasoid European devils they're the ones that develop that type of behavior you know what I mean I mean, there's a whole list on Wikipedia about, you know, uh, sexual violence in South Africa, violence against uh, against infants and children, violence against, against women. It's, it's really just a rape culture. And it's unfortunate, um, you know, that this is a Europeanized behavior that needs to be eradicated. You, you live in a predominantly African, black African country. And the Europeans and their behavior takes over. And it's pretty disgusting. Pretty goddamn disgusting. So, 
Yeah, fam, I just wanted to uh, share this this story real quick about this guy, uh, Nicholas Ninoy, raping this uh, little girl in South Africa. Pretty sad, pretty sad, man. And it's a rape. It's a complete normal rape culture out there in South Africa. And it's got to stop. That cycle has to stop. White supremacy is a global system, and the behavior, which is coming from them, has taken over Africa. All right, fam, those are my thoughts about that. Leave your comments down below in the comment section. I was trying to do a live stream last night. I was just way too tired, so uh, I'm going to try to do something. We'll figure it out. <laughs> we'll, we'll figure it out, family. So anyway, leave your comments down below in the comment section. Let me know what you guys think. Till next time. Chauncey, a.k.a. The Black Separatist, signing out. Peace.